Hey guys, welcome back. Renee here. So as promised, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick house tour for you of my Christmas decor. This is the front of my house. And as you can see, I have two wreaths over there over on the garage. It's really windy. So if you can't hear me, I'm sorry. And then I have my family of deer here. And I did a video of it all lit up. There's my angel. As you come up on my porch, I have my welcome sign, my trees that I made. There's my right side of my porch and the left side of my porch. And then I have the garland going up and over my door that I made there. And then we'll go ahead and head inside here. Puppy, puppy. As soon as you walk in my door to the left, I have this little ladder with some scarves on it. And I have that tree I hauled with some lights on it. I have my pillows here on my bench to put your shoes on and off. And I have my Christmas rug here. And my sleigh. And then on my coat rack here, I have a bunch of Christmas decor here. And on the door, of course, I have my signs. And then as you look to your left, I have some pillows over there and I have my decoration above my window. There is my Christmas tree, the heater in the way, but there's my Christmas tree and my village. It's kind of an overview of everything. So you walk into my living room and I have this table decorated and I have my pillows covered. I have some more pillows covered over here. And then here's a close up of my tree. And you can see it lit in my nighttime video that I did, but pictures of Santa hanging. Here's my little village in the daytime because the nighttime one you can't see it very well. Daisy. And then the sign that I made my ladder with all my Christmas blankets and here's the top of my entertainment center and then of course I have Santa right above my TV some more stuff over here I have so much Christmas stuff you guys stockings more stockings have to dress up the antelope there and then we go into my dining room and here's my table I normally have that candle right there over there, but I lit it this morning. It was dripping everywhere, so I put it on a little plate. And then, of course, I have the Merry Christmas with the two pictures of Santa. And then I also have this tree over here. And sorry, you guys are going to get a horrid glare. I'll try to block it a little bit. That's my kind of snowman tree. So this is kind of that view. And then this is my favorite Christmas decor piece every year. I have 
my daughter, my son, and my sister put their hands on the window and I outline them every year and I take a picture of it so I have them from since they were little. And above there is my, let's see if I can get it to, DIY garland there with some poinsettias on it. And I made that wreath this year up there. And then as you turn to go in my kitchen, this is my snowman room. So start off here, you have my snowman mailbox and a mini tree with all my little snowman on it. And then I have my snow card hanger there, snowman play settings, another bowl of candy, cause y'all know. And then when you come into the kitchen, I have my snowman sign and my new tinsel holder. I wrapped all of my cabinets as gifts this year. And up on top of them, I have some snowman signs and stuff. I have my little snowman everywhere, you guys. So this is, and I hope I can get this window without it glaring too bad. There we go. And here's where I keep all my little snowman knickknacks in this window. And of course with the snowflake hanging above it. <clears throat> my little coffee section over here. Kind of what I have going on. And again, presents wrapped. I have snowman, oh, snowman, snowman everywhere, you guys. And then you turn around to this side of my kitchen. And I have again my pres my all of them wrapped. There's no place like home. I should have put the snowman in the middle of that one. If I'd have known I was going to put it in the kitchen, it's exactly what I've done. Some signs up there. And then my countertops over here. I have my wax warmer with snowflakes on it. Some signs. Some cookies. Some more cookies. <laughs> And then I've got my little snowman corner over here as well. I didn't realize how much snowman. In my laundry room, I just have the wreath on the back door that I did. Other than that, I didn't really decorate. So, and of course I have like all my towels out, which are frumpled right now. Cause, well, I'm gonna be honest you guys. I didn't like go through and clean my house. I just decided, you know what? I'm gonna do the tour today. So you get what you get. Now we're gonna go ahead and walk down towards the hall here. And you have the sleigh, and then you have all the reindeer running up the wall in the hallway. I have the sign, may never be too grown up to search the skies on Christmas Eve, because my kids are getting older now, so, you know. Um, this bathroom right here, I have the, look at my little pumpkin all tiny and small. And my other little pumpkin, tiny and small. Anyway, so here's the garland around the door that I did. And then I have this wreath around the door with the bells. This bathroom, I just have the little Christmas tree here. It's going out of focus. And it's got snowflakes and all that on there. And then I have some garland there on the toilet and I have some penguins hanging. There's LED lights that are snowflakes here. Same over here, I have some LED lights. And then I have this little Christmassy looking flower arrangement and an Oreo. So that's kind of the beach bathroom 
And then onto my daughter's room. See, I told you, I really didn't clean. I was like going to clean and then it didn't happen. As you walk in my daughter's room, she has this. Hers is the elf room. Woo, elf room. So, and then I just have the little door hanger. And then I have a little sign. The best way to spread Christmas chair is singing loud for all to hear. Buddy the elf. So this is kind of like an elf room. So everything's like green and red. And camera's trying too hard to focus. Or let me turn on the light. See if it helps. And then above her window, I did some elves across there with some... garland and some balls hanging from there and then she has her little tree with the elf sitting next to it right here and I didn't have any elf ornaments so I just did her tree the maroon and gold and then over on her dresser she has the little elf snow globe she has an elf hiding there and then Noelle with her little train and then she has this sign that says we elves try to stick to our, the four main food groups candy candy canes candy corn and syrup that's also from the elf and then up top there I just put an elf hat on her thing and then over here she has a couple signs have your elf a merry little Christmas she has a little elf up here and one stash down here. So that's pretty much it in her room. I try not to go too overboard in my kids' rooms because, well, it's their space, not mine. But I do like to decorate a little bit. <clears throat> and then my son's room is, Toyland is the theme he wanted. So he has tons of toys and nutcrackers everywhere sitting out. Maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas perhaps means a little bit more. Just as a reminder. And then I have candy canes hanging from his ceiling here. He's got just kind of toys everywhere. His Christmas tree with the train around it. His Christmas cactus. He's got lights as well up on his garland. He has an elf in here. He normally likes zombie stuff, as you can tell. And there's his toys. And then there's a Christmas book here with another nutcracker, his foosball table, a big giant teddy bear in the corner. And this window has Santa and an elf with some garland. He's got a little, some more candy canes. A tree and Santa here and a nutcracker. And then his laundry basket area. He has this really pretty train. Looks like a toy train. And it's kind of the gist of his room. Sorry, the lighting keeps going, you guys. And then in my room, I had my Christmas blanket on there. And then I had to wash it because I do that all the time. But over on my dresser, I just, I kind of did like angels and um, golds, rose gold, stuff like that. So I just have... A few of those out and then I made the deer with the plaid background I have some lights over my bed and some garland with holly over here and kind of the same thing over here and then on my shelves I put like some of my grandma's knickknacks and I have my tree, hope, my little angel music box. And of course there's 
pumpkins cage with a really bad glare, but also decorated for Christmas. See if I can help the lighting just a little bit. So she has some pine cones and her little Christmas tree. Ooh. Her food bowls are Santa dishes and stuff. Anyways, I didn't do anything in my bathroom. But it's kind of a and I have my on my door my traditional one. And that is it, you guys. That is my Christmas house tour. Pretty quick, pretty simple, but I wanted you guys to see it just so that you guys got a gist of kind of what I did. And like I said, there are tons of stuff everywhere. I hope you all have a very Merry Christmas and a Blessed New Year, and we will see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye.